How's it going, everybody? This is Decode speaking. We've got Baldur's Gate 3 coming your way. All right, this time it gets interesting. We test the boundaries of friendship by letting a little bit of blood go. That's fine. And then we also get a chance to see what the goblins are up to. So check me out. I'm on Twitch. I'm on YouTube. I'm streaming all the time. You might catch me live if you show in. So we'll see you there. Get Dangerous starts now. Uh, all right. Uh, open desk. We took all their stuff. Oh, another pile of books. I didn't see that. Nothing in it. I still don't have a shovel. I need a shovel to dig this up. A poorly drawn map of the city captioned in a flamboyant script. Blackith. What tales of her reach us are terrifying. I suppose that's not how you would describe her. Vlaketh is unity. Fear and beauty. Life and unlife. Eyes like onyx. Teeth like daggers. There is none more perfect. Sounds vile. I assume the meaning of perfect was lost in translation. Alright, what follows is a thorough and accurate account of the city of the people of Baldur's Gate, the sort of gem of the Sword Coast. An editor's note in crimson ink follows. This volume is startlingly accurate, save for the nonsense about the Black Dragon Gate. It is not alive, no matter how many vagrant hags claim otherwise. Commission someone else to draw the map. No effing clue what the hell that means. You seemed quite forward with your compliments earlier. We'd only just met. Seize the day, I say. More now than ever. Careful you don't pull a muscle in your haste. Now we have to continue westward, I think. Um, never wanted the easy path. Wait, this is the one I'm looking for? Yeah. Hopefully, if we can get close enough, we can go to camp and kind of rest up a little bit. I need to recharge my spells. Oh my gosh. There's some shit over there. Off limits. Get to the main gate, or I'll plug you full of arrows. How? You can't see anything. You're basically a gigantic hood. It's the goblin camp. That's get Yankee warrior nonsense. Blade of Frontiers. Am I encroaching on my target? That's the Blighted Village, no problem there. Wait. That's the Goblin Camp. I I'm confused! That's what I'm trying to do. In the goblin camp. Okay. So, before we fucking do that...
The Blade of Frontiers at your calling. Yeah. Carlac's fires raged in Baldur's Gate before she escaped to Avernus, as my source told it. And she was planning to return. One of the Archdevil Zariel's own. Chaos incarnate, a devil with pure fire for a heart. I made my way to Avernus to stop her. She fled from my reach, even climbed aboard the Mind Flayer ship as it screeched through the hells. I followed in close pursuit. I can't bear to imagine the lives Karlak might be taking, the damage she might be doing. Yeah. A powerful friend with a keen interest in privacy. I'm sworn to say no more. You are a warlock. You know about bound souls and frozen tongues. I can only leave the rest to your imagination. Suffice to say, I hunt monsters, devils included, and I will do what I can to quench the coast of their flames. Let's see. Yeah, let's find out. My father once said, one does not pursue a champion's life. One merely answers its call. So it was for me. I was hunting near the cloakwood when I heard it. A child crying out from a lone farmstead. I found him in the fields flanked by goblins. His mother's corpse bled into the soil next to him. I don't remember much of the battle. But I remember drying the boy's tears after. I left him with his uncles. Five years on, and he's flourishing. If only every child was so lucky. I mourn the ones I could never save, whose cries I never heard. In the boy's tears, I finally saw the suffering wrought by the villains of the wild. The frontiers demanded a blade, and so I heeded. I'm gonna just get mean about it. It was an even bloodier day, and a stronger foe. It's made from pure bloodstone, carved from the Galena Mountains just north of the Moon Sea. A reminder that sometimes blood must be shed and sacrifices must be made. Yeah. But that story is reserved for lifetime friends and calmer days. Yeah, let's find out. I want to see. Tiny grooves spider across the ice surface. It resembles a sending stone used to confer with distant contacts. Yeah. A sending stone. <laughs> Nothing so special, I assure you. You watch and listen for signs of deceit, but sense nothing unusual. Well, we get to learn a little bit more about Will and his weirdness. Uh, let's go talk to Shadowheart real quick. After I drop something. What is this? Oh, cool. We can change our equipment. To okay, I get it. Never mind. I'll do that later. Something the matter? There's no story. None that you're entitled to hear, anyway. Just forget you ever saw it. We've been through quite a lot, with likely more to come. Care to narrow it down a little? Our little stowaways, who does he mean? I suppose we'd go our separate ways. Not a slight on your company, of course. I've asked her this before. Perhaps. Perhaps not. 
If we do survive, we'll have separate lives to return to. I need to get to Boulder's Gate. There's someone waiting for me there. Someone I have to reach. As soon as possible. Is that so? Thank you. And you're right. It's a delicate matter. Not something for light conversation. Let's see here. I'm gonna leave for now. Just doesn't really have much else going on. I've got other people to chitty chat chat with. Um, who do I want to bombard out? Well, I can't do anybody else differently. Let's end the day. I wonder if Seems I've got like any other marked dialogues with Starion. Yes. Oh, what's to tell? I'm a magistrate back in the city. It's all rather tedious. Okay. Nothing of note on that one. It's auto select. Forest. You don't sleep well. Flitting between dreams and nightmares. Maybe you wake up because you know something is wrong. Or maybe you just get lucky. Shit. Ooh, what? No, no. It's not what it looks like. I swear. I... I wasn't going to hurt you. I... I just needed... Well blood there in the dim firelight you see him for what he really is a vampire a slave to sanguine hunger the fuck a vampy what's he doing out in the sunlight if he's a vamp it's not what you think i'm not some monster I feed on animals, boars, deer, kobolds, whatever I can get. I'm just too slow right now, too weak. If I just had a little blood, I could think clearer, fight better, please. Ooh, there's a scar on his neck. There's a scar on his neck where he got bit. Courses through you, and your companion's mind unfolds. Secrets half revealed. <laughs> At best, I was sure you'd say no. More likely, you'd ram a stake through my ribs. No. I needed you to trust me. And you can trust me. Hmm. <laughs> Man, he could really break some shit up. Um, Thank you. Do you think you could trust me just a little further? Magic around taste. I swear. make ourselves comfortable shall we oh god does this get weird oh god it gets weird Ugh. it's like a shard of ice into your neck a quick sharp pain that fades to throbbing numbness your breath catches your pulse quickens mm hmm mm hmm mm hmm Made it. This is cool. Hmm? Oh, of course. That that was amazing. 
Well, glad it worked for you. It was weird for me. My mind is finally clear. I feel strong. I feel happy. His guards down the ground. <laughs> Just kick him in the balls. I don't. That felt wrong. Shouldn't take long. So many people need killing. Now, if you'll excuse me, you're invigorating, but I need something more filling. This is a gift, you know. I won't forget it. You watch as he stalks towards the forest, stronger, more confident, ready to hunt. Okay. <sighs> Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Fine and daddy, yes, fine. Well, he has something to say now. Good morning. How do you feel? Little loopy. It'll pass. Just be glad I'm not a true vampire. A bite from them and you might wake up as a vampire spawn. Like my good self. All of a vampire's hunger, but few of their powers. Oh no. I should be cinders in this light. I hadn't seen the sun for 200 years before we crashed here. Wow, that's Someone, wild. Or something wants me alive. They've changed the rules. Standing in the sun, wading through a river, wandering into homes without an invitation. They're all perfectly mundane activities now. As for my other quirks, well, <laughs> we can figure those out in time. Yeah, that's my theory, but who knows? I'm just glad you're being sensible about these uh, revelations. I was worried people might turn up with torches and pitchforks. Although there's still time. So we're traveling with a vampire, are we? Of course we are. A word of warning, Astarian. I taste absolutely awful. <laughs> For his sake. He best not develop an appetite for Gith Yankee. He's not wrong. We're bound together, no matter what comes. Fine. He stays till he's no longer of use. Besides, my flesh is not so easily tasted. Unless, of course, I have offered it. There now. We're all friends again. Shall we go? There's a long day ahead of us. Okay. That was fascinating. I don't know. There's an option for polyamory, and I kind of like that. Although, it might be hard to juggle that shit. <laughs> Why have one when you can have everybody? Just... Enjoy the fruits. Uh, let's try this. Wonder if the gods are watching me. More like the you go, them fleas, you filthy bugger. Heidi, Heidi, Heidi. Stay low and in control, baby. We'll need a cover story. Little blue beetle in my shoe. Bad crit moaning. Ain't moaning if it's true. Ooh, okay, we don't have to go in that way. Successful, yay. It's always a bit of a fucking chance. Nope, 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 nope. I don't like that. That feels like a trap. Get 
Gale? Gale. Quite ready for you. Mm. Yeah, you freaking dip. Waiting with bated breath. Okay, so here's where we are. Came across a bridge. Kind of went south. I wonder if we can go around. Let's try it. More likely you gave them fleas, you filth fucker. Is there an end to this room here? Oh, that's more webbing. I don't need that. Don't waste a step. Well, how they whisper. Looks like a trap there. Stop stepping in that shit, you dingberries. Yeah, sure, stealthy. Gail, I'm, I'm, I'm telling you, brother. I am telling you. Go back to this. I can't be subtle sometimes. Okay, let's do the help action. Actions. Where's the help action at? Grow improved help. Bleed, bloody wall. Ah. You gave them fleas, you filthy bug. Light on my feet. You have to help him now. Jesus Christ. Should have probably just taken a short rest at this point, but we need all of it. Yeah, you're costing us a lot of resources, bro. Alright. What now? Stop sending in traps, that's what. Have to keep going. That's a broad question, sir. There are a lot of abilities. It depends on who you're playing. It also depends on how you're playing. I would say that right now the fighter class is very accurate. And how they do their stuff. What about the priestess? What the hell not? It's a priestess guy! The ability to stealth is amazing. Um, alright. The fact that I have such intuitive... Let's go up here and hide behind this. Hiding failed, but they still didn't seem to care. Words <laughs> are stupid. Alright, yeah, we gotta head up that way. Okay. And the drow? You got it. Bless you, Beaver Drow! Tush, tush, tush. Am I going the right way? Oops. I can't really tell. No, nope, we're not going the right way. We have to go up this way. I was hoping maybe we get into the encampment that way easily, but they're not stopping us at this point. Oh, 
Oh, cool. We made it in past the front guard. the overwhelming authority that you've used on others only infinitely stronger and turned against you your vision clouds leaving you in a dark featureless shadowscape nothingness in every direction then Ooh. there are three figures before you and or you hate to stop but exuding power and command a handsome younger man with a quick, easy smile. And a pale young woman with even paler eyes. These are my chosen. They speak for me. Aid their search for the prison, and you will be worthy to stand beside them in my It's not just a bobble, is it? You feel energy pulsing from the artifact, lifting the pain from you, pushing the voice away. My power grows. My forces gather. Okay. Don't give me that look. I don't know what just happened any more than you do. We should keep going. The voice is gone. Muted by this... This gith relic. Why does a half-elf carry it? I'm not sure I want to know, but it's gone now. We should keep moving. I don't know. Not exactly. All I know is it's important I get it back to Baldur's Gate. At any cost. Well, now we're talking. Yeah, right? I... I am a servant of Shah. My home is a secret cloister in Baldur's Gate. I've heard of this. I need to bring that artifact back there. No matter what. I can't tell you anymore. This mission required utmost secrecy. We all submitted to having our memories suppressed so that we couldn't betray Shah's confidence. If I reach my contact in the city, I'll have my memories restored. Until then, I have to guard the artifact with my life. There. You have the truth. For all it's worth. Let's continue. Let's continue, Worship I agree. Shah. Blimey. She and my beloved Mistra are not exactly friends. True. I didn't think you'd react so pragmatically. Perhaps I should have told you sooner. That's because I'm chill like that. Have I, uh, no, I don't think so. I think I'm still in Act 1, as a matter of fact. Gladly. Let's get to it. Heading straight towards my goal, man. Thanks to Gale. Captured themselves above. The new age is dawning with goblins and trust. Mountains, great mortals, all kinders to quick. She probably needs them less. I'm gonna have her split the item out. Gale, don't waste it. Ah, the fucking knob. Your excellence, best makers of blades. 
in the quarry. <laughs> this guy's singing all scared. Goblin kind will tease you and throw you when redded. His name is Draw Raxon, his voice absolutely. Oh, right on top of him. Come, fill the front row. Hmm? Laugh if you dare, recoil if you must. A God. new age is dawning with goblins and trust. Mountain straight mortals, all kinders to quake. The true souls are coming, their loudness are quick. Here below, I fall and blind to great glory. To all Rexland's best make is a blade in the quarry. Guard Gergen. Or be you beheaded. Statue of Saloon. This room must have been dedicated to her. And now it's a nest for some filthy goblins. A fitting in. That's not Volo in the. Uh... Fragulous crown and with scepter a braid, draw Regslin, short work of the innkeeper made. <laughs> the inn burnt to ash, the captives were many, goblin kind had reduced them to cowering filfenny. So raise it, your goblets, and drain them with pride. Draw Regslin, the true soul. Had led you to land. <laughs> Give me your... Ragulus Galan. Get off the stage. Yeah, let's just. You! Move off! Do what she says. Now. <clears throat> now, where was I, huh? Wait a tick. That a friend of yours? Oh, certainly not. What are you doing? I'm. Busy here. You lying. To you. Never. Come. What Let's is the deal with these two, it. man? <clears throat> draw Ragslin. Uh, draw Ragslin. Um, uh, um, I'm just I, smiling at her. <laughs> draw Ragslin. Um, um, come choose. Uh, draw Ragslin. Uh, um, Get to a point? What the hell? Wait, wait. Draw Ragslin. We pay. We. Come on, pigeon. Back to your cage. Now, oh, look what you've done. Come on. Look. Of course, you man. My name's Gribber. Idiot. Right, yes. More fool than me. Fire wine barrel. Oh, what the fuck? Got the traitor. This camp is massive. More heretical symbols. Definitely don't want to start a fight with this ogre. What is going on back here? We got past the front gate into the goblin camp. And now they're all just drinking Sorry, and doing sir. Me ain't ready yet. Dwarves take an age to roast. He found us. Don't know what he was doing here or where he came from. Lads inside are trying to get answers out of one of his mates. <sighs> nah, 
ruins are all beardy and woodsy, ain't they? This lot were a scabby gang of tomb robbers. And a big old war bear with them, though. Took five of our meanest lashes to chain it up. We'll beat the fight out of it and make it one of our own. <laughs> so that's what happened to it. Thanks, sir. He'll probably spill his guts as soon as he claps eyes on you. He's inside. Keep to the right and follow the screams. <laughs> Okay, so this here, if I am not mistaken, means that we have to go through this entry point. Rescue Volo. I think this is just in the area. I don't think it's actually a... So we're looking for a big-ass bear. Half is too high. Okay. Then he lifts up this mace with his other arm. So I stuck my dagger in that one. No more problems on that one after that. Wow. That gobby just took a piss. Goblin child. Stupid, dead bastard. Give him a good kicking. He deserves it. He killed my mum and dad. Made a bloody orphan of me. Loss holds hands with grief, even among goblins. I ain't bothered about it. Better off without them. Stupid old geezers should have part more of a fight. Don't mean we can't enjoy putting the boot into this prick of stick, though. Well, so much for my previous sentiment. Hundred <laughs> percent. What do you call a trad knickers? That was a dumb joke, but hilarious for how dumb it was. Okay. I don't know if we can go into the doorway. Who's this? I think it's an orc. They're just mixing it up.